Hi everybody, welcome back to Glitterati Glamour. If you don't know me, my name is Kaylin. Hi. So obviously you can see I have my prosthetic already on. I wanted to make sure it was on because you don't need to watch me putting it on. It's just, you just apply, it's like a temporary tattoo. You just put on water. So we have it on. It's not totally blended up here. It's not totally blended whatsoever but we are going to do a minimalistic Halloween look I don't know I just thought maybe if we had something a little bit different I don't know I also had this other half of the prosthetic and I didn't know what to do with it so we're gonna do like a minimalistic like scratch we're gonna put some blood in it we're gonna figure some stuff out but we have to do our base first but we all know base starts with eyebrows this is really for people who love Halloween but don't want to do anything that are like lazy. Me. Um, and I think it's super easy. Also, I'm really hoping it plucks out some of these uh, stray hairs <laughs> from my eyebrows. But let's get into it, shall we? Very good. Now that my brows are cut, I put a little bit of concealer over on the prosthetic too, just because I wanted to make sure it all kind of ends up blending in with my face. Now I'm going to do foundation, which I'm just going to do like a normal glam look, just with a twist. Oh my god, I didn't do concealer on my actual face. Wait, just wait. Oh my god. Now that our base is actually done, um, by the way, I used the Jeffree Star Cosmetics Translucent Magic Star Setting Powder. It's really nice, I really like it, just in case you care. Now we will do our eyes. 
So I will prime my eyeballs and I will be right back. Okay, now that my eyes are primed, I will be going in with the Orgy palette. I want it to be a very nice, sultry, just a natural kind of look, which obviously we are all natural here. Um, so I think if, if you do want to know any of the products I do use, it will all be linked in the description below like I always do. But um, I think I'm going to go with like a bit of a lighter look just because I want the sole focus to be this, right? So maybe I'll do like knee pads all night long and explicit. I think that's what we'll do. So I was just tapping off my brush. I don't know if you can see it. Very good. Um, so I think that's all I wanna do to the eyes because I think I really just want them to be solely focused on that. So I'm gonna grab the um, eyeliner from House Labs. And I'm just gonna do, I'm not gonna do a wing today. I know, shocking. I'm just gonna line the, um, Lash line. Of course I made it thicker than I should, but you know, who am I to say? So now we are just going to curl our lashes and obviously use our, the love of our life, the Kush Mascara. that there's like a huge clump and I almost couldn't open my eye. Anyways, I'm going to throw on a nice red lip because, you know, I don't know, I just think this is just the perfect red. smudged it looks the better. I was thinking about having like watermarks come down like tears but honestly I think this is just it. Now I'm going to add the blood. Okay I've got my q-tips and I will be grabbing into my um, quote-unquote scab blood. Last time I used this I dropped it on the carpet. So we're not gonna do that again. We're gonna make sure it's in the center of our table. And we're just gonna give some dimension to this wound.
There we go. I didn't want it to be dripping like a lot of blood because um, I really want this to like it want like we want it to be minimal, right? Like there's an, if you're going out, you don't want like blood dripping down and like that's like a lot, right? But I think this is just like a simple like haha, I'm glam. No, 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 I'm dying. I'm glam. No, I'm dying. I'm glam. Help me. That's just me every day though. Um, well, I hope you guys enjoyed this. I know I didn't like talk much or and it's not like a real tutorial, but like this is just an idea. You know, this is what I was doing all of October. I just wanted to give ideas. And I think this is a really good one if you just want like a minimal Halloween costume. I don't know. Be sure to follow me on Instagram at glitterati underscore glamour for updates, Halloween photos, what I'm gonna be. And you can follow me on Twitter for updates at Glitterati Glam R. And uh, you'll get to know all the nitty gritty goody stuff. I always forget to post there, but follow it anyways, cause I'll post sometimes. Anyways guys, I love you all so very much and thank you for watching.